All right, you already know, man, all things sports and entertainment. So, Tiafimo Lopez recently did an interview, and they talked about him fighting uh, Tane Davis or Terrence Bud Crawford. Now, we all know T.O., you know, he a bum. He's a piece of shit. And my bad, y'all, excuse my language. You know how YouTube is, but, you know, I'm so sick of this dude, man. So, he, he says, man, what'd he say? Uh... Either one of the monkeys or whatever he's, you know, calling us monkeys and uh, uh, giving us bananas. And the interviewer, you could tell he was taken back, but he ain't nobody called him out on it. He's smiling about it. And I mean, that this, this really this really explains the state of black people. We don't have no backbone. We don't stay on code at all. And it's just funny that pretty much. When it comes to us, it's open season on us. People can say anything about us. And every anytime you do, you see a lot of buck dancers coming out defending their behavior. Like, you're going to have people talk about Tio Fima Lopez. Oh, man, Tio, man, you know, he crazy, dog. He crazy, bro. No, man. But let let Devin Haney. You Y'all remember when Devin Haney told uh, Lomachenko, white boy ain't going to ever beat me? And uh, they got so mad that he had to apologize. You don't remember that? Y'all don't remember when Ryan Garcia went on his rant? Talking about bringing George Floyd out to delete him again and KKK and using a hard R. The minute he did that, what's that boy name? What's that man name? Uh, Deion Sanders' son, Bucky. Man, no, bro, man, Ryan, man. I know Ryan, man. He ain't a racist, bro. But when Tracy Morgan did it, he had to go on an apology tour. Kyrie Irving almost got canceled. Uh, so on and so forth, right? They'll cancel you, but the people can say anything they want about you. But when you say something about somebody else, it's an issue. Hold on, y'all. Let me move my car. My bad, y'all. I'm trying to uh, uh, record a video. And, you know, people want to park next to me and be all in my fucking business. So, anyway, again, excuse the language. But, I got a problem with that. And this is why I'll never support Teofimo Lopez again. He's already said before, the black fighters, this and that. But why? But how come with Terrence Crawford G-checked you, you ain't had nothing to say about it? That's what I'm saying, man. These guys, man, they chumps, man. You know what I'm saying? Like... Him, Ryan Garcia, Caleb Plant threw a drink on Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia ain't do nothing. Like these, these guys, man, they just they chumps, man. You know what I'm saying? And I'm just, I'm so sick and tired of of uh people hating on the hating on on us. And then every time we do, we got these primates who we shouldn't even be sharing the earth with these people, man. I swear, man, I can I cannot wait until the day comes that you know it's gonna be a change. Y'all remember Sega? Y'all remember Sega back in the day? You hit that reset button. I cannot wait, man, because I swear, man, I hate these people, man. You know, I'm I'm tired of I'm I'm sick and tired of us being the only ones ridiculed, smeared. But then when it comes to us, we need to be understanding. You know, y'all got Diddy. Oh, I, I didn't see so many people make videos about Diddy, and honestly, I don't really give a damn about Diddy, honestly. And and and, and if he did things that was illegal against people's will you know then he need to be under the jail he need to be under the jail but y'all when i made a video about josh giddy y'all was on there talking about man y'all gotta understand man josh giddy man he from a different culture when i went out on ryan man ryan not racist man no man bro you you tripping man this is why we oh, we don't have nothing. We don't have no family structure. We don't have no family business. You got other black people now from other countries coming over, taking over everything. This I'm, this is why we have nothing. And we are moving backwards and backwards and backwards as people. And then they got to the point now where they know you're not going to do nothing. George Zimmerman know you ain't going to do nothing. They know you're not going to do nothing. Didn't Derek Chauvin just get out of prison, I believe? What you gonna do about it? But y'all y'all talking about Diddy life in danger, this other person life in danger, but you cool with Takashi 6 9 and all those other rats that then told and got people locked up for decades. Man, listen, man, I'm gonna say this. Everybody know, man, when it comes to us, 
we're the clowns. When it, if if you go back and watch uh uh learn about kings and stuff, you know how they had funny people dancing and stuff. That's all we are, man. We're act to these people, man. They know they know you not gonna do nothing. But I will not support Tio Fimo. And now if he fight Devin Haney, I'm gonna buy to support Devin Haney. If he fight Tank Davis, I'll buy to support Tank Davis. Oh, that's what he was talking about. He was talking about Tank Davis. My bad, y'all. Devin Haney, Tank Davis. But I'm not. I'm, I'm not. I'm not paying for none of this stuff, man. I'm not doing it, man. I'm so. I'm so sick of this guy. I don't like him, and I don't like the fact that y'all don't do nothing about it when he goes on these rants. But I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.